What's up, everybody? It's Josh here. I'm here with Coach T and the rest of our coaching team, and we're going to go over this week's Fast and Furious workout for you. So for this workout, we'll have four stations, two exercises at each station. We're going 15 seconds of hard work, 15 seconds to, rest, or to rotate, and we're going to go in the room two or four times. Who even knows? Let's see how crazy Coach gets today. Okay, you ready, Coach T? I'm ready. Station number one, we're going to start here with our low rope lunge slam. So use that momentum coming up out of that lunge to get that rope up. Use that momentum coming down to slam that rope down as hard as you can here. Now, if for any reason those lunges are hard on those knees, just focus on those rope slams here. The second exercise is our rope wave squat. So get those hands going as quickly as you can, like a drummer on a snare drum, and then we're squatting up and down here, getting as low as you feel comfortable. Again, if the squats are harder on your knees for any reason, just focus on those rope waves. Nice job, team. From there, we're coming over to station number two. We got Coach Carrie over here. She's gonna be demonstrating our kind of sandbag cleans here. So chest up, arch that lower back. Use those hips to yank that bag up and over those hands onto your biceps, and then take it back down to the floor. So it's a deep breath in on the way down, chest up, push that air out as you yank that bag up here. The second exercise is our plank with the bag pull through. So get into that push up plank position. Now Carrie's gonna reach across her body to pull this bag through. Glutes are squeezed tight, kneecaps are pulled up, so strong plank position. Controlled as you pull it through. Try to keep it under your hips and belly button here, not under your chest. The slower you go, the more challenging this is gonna be. Now you can work this from your knees as well if you would like. You can also just focus on that push-up plank for that 15 seconds if you need to. So do whatever you can do well here. Nice job there, Carrie. From there, we're coming over to station number three. Coach Matt's over here. He's gonna be starting with our dumbbell power curls. So using those hips, he's gonna sit back, swinging those dumbbells back, Drive up, use that momentum to catch those dumbbells at your shoulders. So deep breath in, push that air out as you drive up, catching that at your shoulders. Now the second exercise here, maybe it's the same way, maybe you're going heavier or lighter, we have our seesaw presses. After walled up, glutes are squeezed tight, just pressing those dumbbells up as one arm's pressing, the other one's pulling here, just like two pistons in a car. Nice job there, Matt. And then from there, we're over to our last station. Coach T's back. We're gonna be starting with our TRX row, so we're gonna keep it nice and simple here, because I want you to be able to focus on heavy reps here. So neutral, uh, excuse me, Plank position here, you can go neutral grip, you can go palms down, palms up, it's up to you. Squeeze those shoulder blades, push your chest forward at the top, glutes squeeze tight to make this heavier, you step further in. To make it a little bit lighter, you can put one foot back or both feet back. The second exercise here is our kettlebell uh, half kneeling overhead presses. So you can get one knee on the floor, you're gonna press with the same arm as the knee on the floor. So right now, T's got it in that upside down position, a little more challenging on that shoulder, so start with a lighter weight. It's gonna be a little less stable. If that doesn't feel comfortable, you can also grab that kettlebell right there by the bell and pressing it up. So we're doing one arm on the first set. When we come back, you'll switch to the other side. So you're gonna get two sets in on each side here. Okay, that is our Fast and Furious workout for this week. Great job, everybody.